All right, Saturday racing up and going. What did I call this? Uh, Saturday something. Anyways, we're up and running. Uh, we're going to get our B main up and going here at the sound of the tone. Keep it clean. Keep it clean for these first couple of turns. Keep it clean through these first couple of turns here. Well done. Well done. All right, we are off and going on our five-minute B main. Top two going to that A main. Watching that S turn there. That was Gabe getting it wrong. Gets into a pipe. And we got shuffling into that two spot. Phil Rowan's coming by. He's going to click off that first lap into that top spot. And there we go, Ashley Lamb in the two spot. Nice. Brooke Miller in that three. Where is Stacy? There's Andrew Nielsen. Like Stacy got it wrong in that rumble section. We got Phil Rowan, Ashley Lamb, Brooke Miller, Rosen Brubaker, Nielsen, Verdig Lamb, Soto is our running order right now. There goes Phil down that line. Remember, just slow and steady wins the race there. Ashley by that line. Brooke Miller in the hunt. Phil with a little bit of a bobble. Ashley able to catch up just a little bit. Oh, no, Ashley gets off the reservation, hung up in the pipes. She gets marshaled out, dropped into that three spot. That moves Brooke Miller into that three spot. Careful, careful. Let's keep our passes clean, please. 140 in, 320 to go. We got a battle for third place here. Let's step up, step down. That is Brubaker, Rosen, and Lamb. Phil Rowan trying to distance himself from number two, Brooks, as he works his way through that rhythm section. Rosen moves into that three. Ashley gets up into that four spot. She's going to set her sights on Dave Rosen. Dave Rosen had a little bit of ball, step up, step down. Keeps it rubber side down there. Rosen flips it over. Here comes Ashley moving on to the inside. Rosen drafting off of Ashley there down that straightaway. You could have put a piece of paper in between the two of them coming down that straightaway. So Ashley moves into that three spot, followed by Rosen. Rosen's hot on her trail. Is it worth her way through that center section? Oh, Rosen puts it upside down. That's going to allow Ashley to get away from a little bit. And that's going to be second place working with that gaggle of cars there. You see that car working up, watching that. Drive the driver's hand, watch the driver's hand. That was number two getting into it. I'm not sure who that blue car is going into that step up. That is number two. So Brooke Miller running into some back markers there. That allowed Ashley to gain quite a bit of distance there. She is on the back of Brooks as they come by two that start finish line. Two minutes in, there's still three to go. Scratch that three down, two to go. Second and third working their way in that center section. Watching that step up, step down. Phil Rohn's got about a half a lap on second place right now. Brooke got it wrong. A little squirrely step up, step down. That allow Ashley to get around. Ashley goes a little bit wide off that sweeper, but stays out in that two spot. Just settle in and run your laps. You know what to do. Phil Rosen got a little bit wrong there. Ashley Lamb's working her way into that center section. Brooke Miller still in the hunt. Looks like Phil had another bobble there because here comes Ashley and Brooke. He had about a half a lap. Ashley puts it upside down, lands on her wheels. Still holding on to that two spot. That allowed Phil to break away just a little bit. One minute left. And Brubaker and Soto, that is going to be your leader working up on you. You see that fluorescent yellow car, that's your leader. Watching that step up, step down, that's actually getting a little wrong. Has to get marshaled out, she's going to drop to the three. Brooks, Brooks going to move into that two spot as he works his way in front of the driver's stand. And here comes Ashley in front of the driver's stand now. 35 seconds, 35 seconds. Just keep your head down and run those laps you know how to run. Don't force the issue.
With 20 seconds left, 20 seconds left. Is that Brooks going to get around for one more? See if Ash is going to get around for one more. And she will. Those top three drivers probably going to be done. This is going to be their last lap, so finish out strong. Phil Rowan puts it out of bounds. There's Brooke. That step up, step down. Phil's going to stay out on top. It's going to be Phil and Brooke going to cross that start line. One and two. Everyone else is going to be done when you cross that start finish line. Phil and Brooke, you guys are going to bump into that A main. Everyone else will be done. We're waiting on Rosen and Nielsen. Everyone else is done. Everyone else is done. All right, that is a race. All stop, all stop. Marshalls, grab your blowers. Marshalls, grab your blowers. Completed. Blow off your area. Mitch Brubaker and Evan. Mitch Brubaker and Evan. Can I get both of you to marshal the next race? Take a, You can take a knee here and just uh, help me out the next one. You guys got that? You give me a thumbs up if you got it. Marshal me for race number three. Mitch and Evan, thank you very much. We need the rest of those drivers down on the track. Before we get race number two up and underway, underway, so. That didn't way it work out the way I wanted to because Mitch is running back to back here. All right, guys, you guys go and roll them out, check them in. One minute to the start of the race. Grass Monkey. Kyle Ash. Blake Palmer. B Main. All right. No one else Neil's down that straightaway. No one else down that straightaway. 45 seconds to the start of the race. Mike Baxter. Chucky Stacker. Eighth spot. Mitch Brubaker in the seven. Niels Clenshaw in the six, Brett Kaiser in the five, Kyle Ash in the four, Chucky Stacker in the three, Mike Thirty Baxter seconds to the, the start two, of the race. Blake Palmer and your top qualifier, Riley Schaefer. Sorry, I didn't have the echo going. I'll get it going for the next one. All right, let's get them stacked up. Let's get them stacked up on the grid. Fifteen seconds to the start of the race. Oh, Mark made it. Nice. All right, Mark, you're in spot Less number nine. Yep, Brubaker in eight. And Mark on race number nine. All right, so when we start here, Mr. Rowan, when we start here, don't grab a fistful of throttle. Let's keep it single file. All right. All right, we're going to let this ride. All right. Marshall's ready. Driver's ready. Let's go race into the sound of the tone. Well done, Mark. Well done. All right. Good single file. Good single file here. Nice driving, boys. Nice driving, boys. Saw a little bit of a bump, but we waited. That was awesome. That's what I like to see. All right, we are off and running. Our six-minute truck main. Blake moves around Riley. Riley went off, went out of bounds for a two-stroke penalty. He lost a couple of spots there. All right, so Blake moving out to that one spot. Looks like Mike Baxter moved into that too. Kyle in the three, and Riley Schaefer, our top qualifier, had a little rough beginning lap there. Had to get Marshall out. It's getting the four right now. Oh, we are, it's a long race, long race, one minute into our six-minute main. Boop, boop, boop. 
All top four drivers all within a straightaway with one another. Blake out front. Baxter in the two. Ash in the three. Riley giving chase. Riley goes tight on the inside. Full throttle. Gets around Kyle. Moves into that three spot. I don't know. Brett Palmer puts it upside down. Then Baxter puts it upside down. And just like that, Riley Schaefer's back up into the lead. There goes our leader down that straightaway by that start finish line. Blake caught on the path in the two spot. Kyle moves up into that three. Baxter falls to the four. Watch by the turn of the driver's stand. Watch in front of the driver's stand. Watching that step up, step down. Watch behind you, Phil. Phil, behind you, behind you, behind you. Oh, there goes Palmer upside down. In a rough section, everyone's getting marshaled there. Still got three and a half minutes left. Still got three and a half minutes left. Put your head down. Reset and start putting those laps in. You know how to do. Riley up on top, working that associated. T6, through the rhythm section he goes. And the metallic blue down by the start finish line. It's, it's, it's Riley Schaefer. 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 And that two, Kyle Ash moves into that two spot. Baxter in the three. Riley Schaefer out front, Kyle on the two, Baxter in the three. Then it looks like we got Chucky. Blake, Mitch, Clenshaw, Brett Kaiser in the mix somewhere. Watch that step up, step down, two minutes to go, two minutes to go. Two minutes left. Watching that S turn in front of the driver's stand, it is cleared out. All right, so everyone's working with somebody except for Riley. Riley's got a full head of track in front of him. He is looking to put a lap on three. He's coming up on Mike Baxter, yikes. I found pieces of his car in that exact spot. He needs to be careful working his way through there. He is working up on that step on, step down. Number two, Kyle Ash working his way. And that S turn is going to be in that rhythm section. So we got a stadium truck in the lead, a short course in second. And third place is stadium truck as well. That is Mike Baxter. He's got a rear view mirror full of a lot of cars there. I'm not sure Chucky got around him that time. I'm like, oh, watch going on that straight. Watch going on that straight. Marshall, Marshall, Marshall. Pay attention to your spots, please. Pay attention to your spot. I know you like watching the races. It happens to all of us. Looks like Chucky took over that two spot. Chucky in the two, Baxter in the three. It looks like after that mess, Baxter got back up into the two. And there goes there go Riley, Riley putting Riley, a Riley, lap Riley, on, on the field. 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 By the start finish line, he goes. Not quite yet. He's holding on. Baxter, Baxter, do not let him pass you. Full aggression is authorized. Baxter won't do that, though, because he's a gentleman. Oh, no. Watch out for the X Factor, Mark Rowan. Mark Rowan holding his own in this easy. 
All right. <laughs> Everyone's going to be done when you cross that star finish line. There's your winner, Riley Schaefer, taking that win. There's Baxter. Oh, Chucky was giving it. To, oh, Chucky barely misses out. He's going to have to settle for third. There's Ash in the four, Kyle in the five. We're still waiting on some cars to finish. We're waiting on Blake Palmer, Glenshaw, and Rowan to finish out. All right, that is a race. That is a race. I'll stop. I'll stop. Marshalls, grab your blowers. Marshalls, grab your blowers. The race is completed. Race number three is going to be coming up next. Race number three coming up next. We need all those drivers from race number four, or sorry, race number two. Down on the track. All those drivers from race number two. We need you down on the track to Marshall. Thank you guys for blowing off your respective se sections. All right, race number three. You, oh, hold on, let's cl let's clear Mark out of there before you guys get nuts. One All minute right, to the go start ahead of the roll race. Roll them out. Check them in. Forty-five uh, seconds Mr. to the start Baxter, of the race. Can you just Kevin help Gaffey. me out on the next race? Can you help me out on the next after this race? Oh, you are okay. Okay, that's Ryan fine. Collard. Yeah, just help me out when you can. Todd Farnham, thirty seconds to the start of the race. All right, in that four spot, it's Nick Bayette. In the three, Todd Farnham. In the two, Kevin Gatton. And your top qualifier. Ryan, 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 Caller, Caller, Caller. 15 seconds to the start of the race. All right, we'll let Nick be it. Come around and check it Less out. Less than watch, five. Uh, watch it straight away. We're going to let Nick come down. You got cars slowing down there, Nick, so just be careful coming down that straightaway. Go ahead and take one more. Take, take one more. All right, you guys are welcome to take another one if you want. I'm just going to let Nick hop on out there and get around. And no one else down that straightaway. No one else down that straightaway. Let's get them gridded up where you want them. All right, Marshall's ready. Driver's ready. Let's get it on at the sound of the tone. <laughs> our four-wheel drive mod slash expert. So expect to see a breakaway from these top two drivers and then the three and four to be battling it out. <laughs> All right, so we got Todd leading out that expert division followed by Nick Bayette, Nick Bayette. Have a little bit of rough luck in qualifying, but he's got what it takes to contend with the best of them here. So he's going to give Todd a run for his money as they both work their way through that rhythm section. Right now we got Caller up top in the mod division, but Gatton's not letting him get out of his sights. Any given day, these two can top one another. We're racing for pride right now. Right now it's Caller, followed by Gatton. Separated by just over a second. It's like Nick got around Todd, so Nick's going to take over that top spot in the expert division by the start finish line. He goes. Gap was 3.2.
There we go. So we got Nick out front, Todd in the two. Todd had a little bit of a bobble. Nick got around, but he's still not too far off. Then Keller and Gatton are neck and neck going to that step down over that rumble strip. Oh, I owe you guys a minute. Get that fixed up for you. Here we go, 2.30 in, 3.30 to go. It's Nick Bayett on top on that expert division, followed by Todd Farnham. Ryan Keller has got the better of Kevin Gatton as it is right now. 2.6 separates the two as they both come by that star finish line. Keller airs out that quad. Gatton airs out the quad. Double quad, they go through that center section. Gatton shaved a couple tenths off right there. It was 3.4, it's now 3.2. All right, so Caller playing it a little safe. Gatton going full noodle. Two seconds separates the two now. Now they're right back where they usually are, neck and neck through that center section. <laughs> Gatton goes for it. Does not work out for him. Caller able to pull away. Looks like Nick has built a sizable lead over Farnham. And he gets stompered by Ryan Caller coming in hot. Going on Two that straight away. Minute 50 left, minute 50 left. Race number four, our 21.5 A main is gonna be up next, watching that step up, step down. All right, now we got ourselves a race. It is Caller and Gatton. We're gonna wait <laughs> down the straightaway they go. Over that quad, they both go. Yeah. Yeah, it's 20. Yeah. Caller went One out of bounds. That allowed Gatton to stretch out. So now Gatton goes huge over that quad. And Caller's just now going over the quad. So Caller had quite the hang up there with 45 seconds left. So now it is Gatton's to lose. Collar's gonna d dial his beast mode up to one hundo. Oh, they get bit. They Nick Bayette and Gatton both got into it. Allowed Collar to come around. Eighteen seconds left. We'll see if they get around for one more. If they throw down some heaters, they possibly will. Oh, no, Gatton boxing that step up, step down. There goes Caller, and then Caller gets it wrong. It's going to be a race to the line. Caller on that last lap gets around him and takes the win. So Caller's going to take the win. Gatton in that two. Nick Bayette's going to take the win in expert division. And Todd in that two. Marshalls, grab your blowers. Marshalls, grab your blowers. Our 21-5 A mains coming up next.
All right, we need all those drivers from that last race. Down on the track. And we'll need uh, those volunteer marshals I asked to come on out. Please come on out and volunteer. Grab a cone. All right, now we need some marshals out on the track, please. Marshals out on the track. You guys can go to roll them out. Check them in. The race is completed. Yeah, no problem, man. All right, in the 10 is Brooke Miller in the 9, Anderson. Bill Rowan in the 8, Anton Morissette in the 7, Brett Palmer in the 6, Mike Todd Farnham Mike Baxter. in the 5, Larry, Larry Westcott. Westcott in the 4, Todd Mike Caller in the 3, Nick Fayette, Fayette. Brett in the 2, Mike Baxter and your Brooke top Miller. qualifier, dominating Hello. the dojo. Anton yeah. Morissette. Yeah. All right, uh, no one else down that straightaway, no one else down that straightaway. Grid them up, grid them up. Let's get some marshals out here. I'm gonna start calling out names here that I know. Uh, let's see here. Uh, Riley, can you come out and help me marshal? Hey, Ethan, you can make up for missing by coming out marshaling for me. Actually, never mind. I need you to, I need you to, you know, do the thing. So yeah, you're free. Right on, Mitch. Thank you very much. One minute to the start. Are you gonna hop out there? We just need one more in the. On the bucket. And one more on the bucket. Just need one more on 45 the seconds to the start of the race. I would ask Jim or Randy, but it's on the bucket. You know. We need we need uh we need someone a little more spry up on that bucket. All right, Miss Lamb's got it. Thanks, sir. It looks like 30 seconds like, to the start uh, of the race. She beat you out. You get karma points, however. In fact, um, sir, would you hop on over there, code number nine? You know, in fact, um, we actually need someone on code number four. Can you? Can you? Fifteen go seconds to the start of the area? race. Yeah, Ryan can take care of this area. Less All than right, five. drivers, twenty-one five A main. You know the rules. Keep everything clean. Keep it above the belt. And everything I say, you must obey. Keep it clean for the first couple turns and then have at it. Let's go racing at the sound of the tone. All right, fair enough, fair enough. All right, we are off, we are off. Watch, going in that end section there. Nick Bay getting a little bit wrong. That opens the door for Caller to take a spot. Can't quite get it, though. And the two All-Americans are going to battle it out by this start finish line. Bayette's in that three. Caller in the four. Lay is still out front. Looks like Mike Baxter is holding on to that two spot. So one and two work their way through that rhythm section. And it looks like Caller moved into that three. Bayette's going to fall to the four, and he's got... Westcott, hot on his trail. Down that straightaway he goes. So right now we got Leia, Baxter, Caller, Bayette, Westcott, Varna, Miller, Palmer, Rowan, and Morissette. Leia ran in a little bit of trouble. I did not see what happened there. And then she puts it upside down to that center section. It's a six-minute main. It's a six-minute main. That's going to move. That's going to move Baxter into that one spot. Caller into the two. And then we got Bayette in the three, Lay in the four. Caller puts it upside down, going on a step on, step down. That allows Caller and Lay to both close the gap. Scratch that, Caller or Nick and Lay to close up a little bit. So while two, three, and four are having their issues, Baxter is not. And he is trying to stretch out and check out here early. We're only two minutes in, though, to our six-minute main. 
Anything can happen. Two, three, and four by the start finish line. It is Bayette, Keller, and Anderson. Make sure we stay clean coming onto that straightaway there. Bayettes, yes, yeah, salute as they come by. The All American boys coming up in front of that driver's stand. Keller goes to the inside and takes over that number two spot. And number one's got it upside down in that rhythm section. That's going to be your leader, all red, working his way onto that straightaway. So Baxter had a little bit of a rough one there, trying to navigate his way through some lap traffic. That allowed Caller to close the gap a little bit. Baxter pushes it wide, and here comes Caller. These guys hashing it out. Phil, you're going to have three working with you right there behind you. Thank you very much. So one, two, and three are all stacked up together. So Baxter lost a lot of his lead. Caller's going to set his sights on the top spot. Watch on that step up, step down as one, two, and three work their way through that rhythm section. Step up, step down is clear. Uh, you three coming by that start finish line. That's one and two working up on you. Brooke, that is first and second working up on you. I know you're battling out on your own, but I'll call this out for Mr. Palmer as well. Mr. Palmer, that's going to be one and two working up on you. Well done. Game on. Oh, Baxter put it upside down and collects Caller. Number three is nowhere to be found. Somehow, Baxter stays out front, though. Two minutes Both left. of them got it wrong. That was their chance. Bayette moves into that, is in that three spot and is trying to strike. And we got Farnham now moving up into that four spot. Leia in the five, Morissette, Palmer, Miller, Rowan, Westcott. Minute 45, our closest battle is going to be between Palmer and Miller, separated by five-tenths of a second. However, Mike Keller and Bayette battling out for that two spot, separated by seven-tenths. One, two, and three. Oh, they get into each other. I know you guys are scrapping, but let's keep things clean, please. Baxter gets it wrong. Keller gets it wrong. Keller's going to have to slow go down that step up, step down. Let's allow Baxter to get back around. And there's Larry. Larry's going to dive in. Had that top spot. I'm not sure what's going on right now. Baxter had the top spot going by that start finish line. Lay moved into that two. Bayette in the three. 54 seconds left. This step up, step down has got these guys' numbers. I think Baxter's going to be in that one. Leia's making strides, but Bayette's going to be in the two, followed by Leia. Looks like Westcott's a, a lap down there. Sorry about that. I thought you were contending there. That's going to be number two or three working with you. Watching that rhythm section, these closing seconds, fatigue starting to set in. Everyone, Kyle's getting a workout. Limbering up for that two-wheel A main. 10 seconds left, 10 seconds left. Baxter finally settled back into that win, slows it down a little bit in that rhythm section, makes a smart move. They head in the two. Looks like Kyler's still in that three spot. Leia in the hunt. Kyler got it upside down. What happened to Leia? There's Leia getting by. So Baxter, Mike, Baxter, you're done. Bayette, you're done. Leia's going to swing in, take that three spot. Everyone's going to be done when you cross that start finish line. 17-5 A mains coming up next. Yikes. All right, drivers, you guys know the deal. Go ahead and set your cars down. Don't go to the pit. Set your cars down. Come out to Marshall Positions. Should have plenty of you guys to cover all of the our cones. Completed. 
Getting ready for our 17-5 aim main. Coming at you guys here in just a brief moment. But right after this race, we will do a light water. Thank you, drivers. All righty. 17-5, you can slowly roll them out, check them in. Do not break your cars on warm-up. I need to see all those marshals out to positions, please. I got a couple empty cones. Got one right over here in the end of the rhythm section. As always, guys, space yourselves out. Jesse no harm, no foul. That should have plenty of guys. I do appreciate everyone making the... Caleb now watch. guys, don't hit our marshals. Let Randy me get their spots. Colton Cruz. Blake Palmer. Ken Kennedy. Oh, hot diggity dog. Jimmy Lett. Like we got all Thomas of our Earn. marshals covered. Blake Anderson. Perfect. Be main. Ant yep. If one of you guys want to go there, I appreciate Anton. You're good to go. You you helped Rich Joe multiple Hart. times today. You're free to go. My man, thank you. That's what Karma does. Alrighty, guys. And yeah, it looks like we are good to go. Marshall's cars are ready. Watch at the end of the straightaway. Alright, straightaway is closed. Straightaway is closed. Let's get them lined up. It's going to be on our 11th spot. It's going to be Caleb. On the 10th, it'll be Shenard. On the 9th, it'll be Ken. One minute to the start on of the, the race. On the 8th, it's going to be Les Anderson. On the 7th, it'll be Thomas Herb. On the 6th spot, it's going to be Blake Palmer. On the 5th, it's going to be Riley Schaefer. On the 4th, will be Jesse. On the number 3, James Leffler. Randy Lockett on the two, and on the pole tonight is going to be 45 Colton seconds Cruz. to the start of the race. Yeah, don't worry about that. All right, marshals, please look alive. Watch your areas, please. Be mindful. As your drivers look at those cars lined up. So we got 11 of you. So you guys know the deal. Work together, work to together. All righty. Marshals ready. Drivers ready. We're going racing on the sound of the tone. Keep it clean, keep it clean. You guys know the deal. Work together, work together. There it is. Nice single file line out of all of you guys. This is how it should be done. And we're off right as they start single file line. We got Colton out front, followed by Randy. Watch it in the rhythm, watch it in the rhythm. They are coming. Watch it on the tabletop, watch it on the tabletop. We got one more. Whoop. Be careful, Marshalls, please. Appreciate the hustle, but I don't want to see you guys fall. All right. We got kind of mayhem everywhere. Your top four kind of separated out. We got Colton in the one, Randy in the two, Leffler in the three. I believe Jesse making a mistake right there, but he's in the four. And then we got, I believe, Riley Schaefer, Chenard, Kennedy, Caleb, Palmer, Thomas, and Les right on your field. One more. Watch it. Thank you, Phil. Work together, drivers. We got six minutes. We got one minute down, sit, five minutes to go. You're a leader. Colton Cruz coming down that straightaway right now. Right by the start finish line, he is your leader. That all yellow, I believe a little bit of orange, yellow wheels, triple. Tabletop going over the little pool section, I call it. Watch going in the tabletop section. Watch it. Thank you. Leffler now making his way up to the number two spot. Randy Lockett into the three. We got a good separation here. Jesse still holding that over four spot. Schaefer in the five. Watch after the quad section. The front set. Work together, drivers. Work together. That is your leader. Colton Cruz going through that rhythm section. Right there on that tabletop. All yellow right behind you. You guys know what to do. Thank you, guys. As always, Palmer and Ken. You got the leaders right behind you. Third or Second and third were right there. Leffler kind of giving a wheel to Randy. Uh, I saw that. No holds bar now. As always, guys, keep in mindful of your leaders. I believe Ken, that would be second place up on you. Work together, guys. One more. We got one set. Watch in the rhythm. Ooh. Be careful, Marshalls. Unfortunately, I didn't see that. Bad luck right there. Watch it in the rhythm. Watch it in the rhythm. Oh. All right. With 11 cars, you can see how mindful you're a leader getting tangled up there in that rhythm section. All oh, yellow, orange, yellow wheels, V6.3. Come on, the start finish line right now. So I missed what happened. But Leffler going up to the pole position here. R race announcer today. Going through that rhythm pack. Double, triple, single. Nice and clean on him. Cruz right there behind him. Leffler makes a mistake. Your leader. Get some mistakes. So now we're gonna have a shift change. So watch come down the straightaway. We got J Leffler in the two. Jesse in that TLR right behind him. Red, silver, and blue as they go through this triple tabletop section. 
That is for position. Leffler rolls it over. Whoa, almost sends it in to Jesse, but Jesse now in the number two spot as they do. Triple, single, onto the tabletops. They go. Your leader, Colton Cruz with 245 to go. The battle's shaping up right here for number two spot as Jesse's got it. James wants it to go over the front. Triples over the tabletop, nice and smooth. Second and third is there. Colton making the look, giving more pressure now. He's got a 4.8 second gap. Leffler makes a mistake in the rhythm. Jesse's going to have a little breathing room. No harm, no foul. Leffler's got less behind him, but less knows what to do. Keeping it smooth and collective. So with 220 to go, we got Colton out front, followed by Jesse, Leffler, Schaefer, Lockin, Chenard, Palmer, Anderson, Kennedy, Knobloch, and Herb out early. That is your field right now with 205 to go. Thank you, Shinar. That is your leader. All right, two now your left. battle's still shaping up. Jesse is in the two. Jane uh, Leffler in the three. So separation between second and third, about 2.8. So Jesse's got a little bit of a gap. Watch it through the rhythm. Ah, Leffler escapes that smoothly. Just by the hair on his chinny chin chin there with 140 to go, drivers. Your leader right now is Colton Cruz. See if we can find your leader in that all yellow. I believe with some hints of orange on there. I'm colorblind. On top of that tabletop through the little moguls coming down that straightaway right now is your leader. Please don't run across the track, bud. Please stay right there. Please stay by that pole. As Grandpa is saying, please stay right there. Watch it by in the rhythm. You're uh, clear with 115 to go, drivers. 115 to go. Your leader, Kang, or Colton, right now. Coming down that back straightaway. Jesse in the two. Leffler in the three. And Schaefer, Lockin, Chenard, Anderson, Palmer, Kenny, and Knobloch. Right now at your field here. One minute left. You earn a five down, one to go, drivers. Your leader going through that rhythm section. Triple, single, nice and clean. Up on the tabletop. Look at the hustle out of Phil. That is fantastic. Let's see here. See if we can see the battle for second shaping up right here. There comes Jesse by the line. Here comes Leffler. Separation was 2.8. Now it's 1.4. So, Palmer, you're going to have second place coming up on you along with third. So you know what to do with less than 30 to go, drivers. Less than 30. Fantastic. 20 seconds to go. Battle, close to battle on the track is going to be between Jesse and Leffler. Separation now is 1.9. Well, it's 1.4. Watch going in the rhythm. It is clear. 10 seconds to go, drivers. 10 seconds to go. As you cross the line, you will be done. Locking, you're done. Not block. Jesse. Ba -da -ba -ba. Chenard is done. Leffler is done. Like I said, as you cross the line, you will be done. Wait on four more driver marshals. Ken is done. Les is done. Wait on Schaefer and Colton. Here they come. Colton and Shave, that's their race. Colton taking that one, 18, 6, 17. So you had Colton, Jesse, Leffler, Schaefer, Lockin, Chenard, Anderson, Palmer, Kennedy, Knobloch, and Herb out early on. The race is complete. As always, Marshalls, grab those blowers, blow off your areas, please. We are gonna put a light coat, we're gonna put a coat of water down, and then we're gonna have race number six, our sportsman foil up next. All right, and out tonight's going to be race number seven, our two-wheel modified class. Boogity boogity. Just couldn't hold the pressure, could you there, Leffler? I buckled. You buckled hard. Jesse had your number all night. Thank you. Kyle Wolf. Ken Kennedy.
Gabe Soto. Evan Burdick. Man, you guys are ready to go. You don't even want practice laps. You just want to get after it. <laughs> Once I clear this hose, you guys are free to roll around a few. All right, go ahead and roll them out. Check them in. Take a couple of laps. We'll give you guys about 50 seconds. Watch by the driver's stand, watch by the driver's stand. Deep soda. All right, in the five, it's Evan Ferdig in the four, Brooke Miller in the three, Gabe Soto in the two, Kyle Wolf. And on the pole is, 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 is Ken, 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 Kennedy. Kennedy, 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 Kennedy. <laughs> it's not going to get old for a while. All right, are all you guys right, good? Right, you guys right, good? Right, good? Right. You guys can roll around another uh, couple laps if you want, but if you're good, stack them up. Ken Kennedy, Brooke Miller. All right, someone's going to take advantage. Ken's going to take a, another one. Yikes, that almost ended poorly. All right, let's, uh, no one else down that straight away. It's going to grid it up, grid them up. And we'll get our 13.5 Sportsman A main. Make sure we get you guys your full six minutes. All right. One we'll minute to the start of the race. race of attrition here. Keep your car together and run some clean laps. You'll walk away with a win. Uh, I'm not sure if I'm having issues. All right, Marshall's ready. Driver's ready. Loops. I'm sorry. 45 Let's go seconds racing. to the start of the race. The sound of the tone. Here we are. Sportsman four wheel is up and underway here. Ken and Kyle Soto getting around some traffic there. Tries to cut a little too short. It's got some Marshall himself settling in that third spot right now. But we got Ken and Kyle going at it. Down that straightaway they go. <laughs> Kyle spinning around halfway down the <laughs> straightaway there. That's going to allow Ken to break away just a tad. Remember, it's six-minute main, so there is plenty of time. No need to grab a fistful of throttle and force the issue. Just run the laps you know how to run. And things will come together for you. Ken puts it upside down, but no harm because he has got a sizable lead right now. Kyle moves into that two. Gabe still in the three. Then we got Brooke and Evan fighting it out.
Second and third having a little issue going through that rhythm section there. They're a little off their tempo. Ken is starting to amass a sizable lead. He might need that later on, though. We're only 130 in, 3, 4, 430 to go. Ken in the one, Wolf in the two, Soto in the three. Then we got Brooke and Evan. Closest battle right now is going to be between Gabe and Brooke. The gap was three tenths. Looks like it's much larger than that now. Two fifteen and three forty five to go. Ken still out front. No one's looking to contest him as it is right now. Kyle's looking solid in that two spot. Brooke moved up into the three. Gay falls to the four, and Evans rounding out the field. Take a ride, flyer leader. Ken Kennedy by that start finish line, working his way in front of the driver stand right now. It's going to go triple tabletop. Through the sweeper he goes, down in the pit, up over the kicker. Working his way into that rhythm section. He's going to go double, triple, single. It's the way to go in that sportsman's class. Step up, step down. Through the rumble strip and down the straightaway he goes in his red, white, yellow wheel, four-wheel drive car. I'm not sure what he's running. All right. Normally I'd call you a stop and go, but that's all right. You, I think uh, you knocked over every single thing that was available over there, except for Chenard. <laughs> you got, you got the blower, the cone, and yourself. Ken of the one, Kyle in the two. Brooke closing in on Kyle. And there is the race right there between Kyle and Brooke. Working the way in front of that driver's stand right now. Kyle looks like playing a little too conservative, and Brooke is taking advantage as he is starting to put some laps together. And then something happens to Brooke. Brooke breaks out. So Two minutes left. Kyle's going to breathe a sigh of relief as attrition starts to set in with four down and two to go. Kyle sitting comfortable in that two. No one contending with him right now. Ken coming around that rhythm section, working, we're trying to do what he can to put a lap on the field in our long extended six minute main. Our final race will be up next. That is our two wheel drive modified. Again, if you have a tab open, please go inside and square that away before you leave. And hope you all had a good time tonight. Hope you had enjoyed the extended mains. Still getting out of here at a decent hour. The track will be open for practice for an undetermined amount of time after the final race. So if you're looking to work some things One out, you're left. welcome to stay and run a couple more laps. Yeah, don't let him do it, Kyle. Oh, he gave it up. He didn't want to give up that lap to the leader. There you go. Take it back. Without breaking them, of course. All right, there goes Ken putting a lap on the field. They go side by side. <laughs> Kyle <laughs> tries to push him into the wall. <laughs> Ken's just going to kick back just a little bit. Last thing he wants to do is break out with this sizable lead, 32 seconds left. I don't think anything's going to happen at this point. There you go, Ken and Kyle. Working together with one another and going to get around for their final lap more than likely. 15 seconds to go. Let's see if Evan gets around for another one. Oh, not like that. You ain't. You still got nine seconds. You might make it. Oh, there you go. You got it. All right. Everyone's going to be done when you cross that start finish line. Ken, you are done taking that win. Kyle, you are done in that two spot. Kyle enjoying these sportsmen coming out and racing with them. 
having their own class, even though only three of them finished. Evan still needs to finish. We still got one going. Evan made it around by the skin of his teeth, and here he comes, finish it off in that three spot. That is a race. All oh, stop, all stop. Race is completed. Marshalls, grab your blowers. Marshalls, grab your blowers. We're going to need all five of those drivers on the track, uh, along with two or three volunteer marshals. And we'll get our last race up and going. All right, I want a full complement of marshals today. So this last race, let's get them going. All right. All right, I'm gonna let these guys go. Clear the track, clear the track. Driver's race number seven, go ahead and roll them out. Check them in. In the five, Ethan Kowalski in the four. Kevin Gatton in the three. Ryan Collar in the two. Big Jim Silva and her top qualifier of the night, Kyle, 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 Kyle Davis. Kyle. Davis, Davis. Hmm. One minute to the start of the race. All right, let everyone get around for one more. Ryan Collar. Except for Jim. Brody. Gee whiz. Go ahead, Jim. All right, no one else down that straightaway. 45 no seconds to the start straightaway. of the race. Jim Silvey. Track will be open until 5.30, says the, says the panda. All right, let's get them all. 30 seconds to the start of the race. We'll get six minutes underway. Let's get some marshals out here. Uh, hey, uh, Nick, Todd, and um, Herb, will you hop on out and marshal for me, please? If you're able. 15 seconds to the start of the race. Is that a no for you? Are you differently abled? Are you not able to hop on out there? Yeah. Less than five. Are you, t you're Todd, right? Oh, you know what? We're, we're good, Todd. We're good. We're good. Yeah, you got, he, he's got right here. I'm sorry. I just didn't see him. All right. Thank you to our volunteers. Our voluntolds, I should say. I appreciate it. All right. Marshall's ready. Driver's ready. Let's get it on at the sound of the tone. Six minutes, two wheel modified, up and underway. Good clean start out of these boys. Expected nothing less. Kyle Davis gonna hang on that whole shot. Sylvie gonna get a little squirrely. Lose a couple positions, that's all it takes here in the opening seconds. You get a little bit squirrely, those guys will be right behind you. Gant puts it upside down, he's gonna fall so down to the Bottom of the grid. Kyle Davis on the one. Caller in the two. Sylvain in the three. Ethan in the four. And Gatton. <laughs> Sylvain puts it upside down. Going on on that straight away. Probably going to blame me somehow. Kyle on the one. Caller spins it around like a record. That allows... Ethan, uh, Ethan boxed it off the pipe. There goes Gatton. So Gatton was in the back. He is now in that two spot. So just like that, he made up plenty of time there. And Kyle's reaping all the benefits. Well, these bottom four slap each other silly. Kyle says, peace out. So he works his way in that rhythm section. Up on that step up, step down. And over that bobble strip. Down the straightaway he goes. Gatton making up a ton of time there. Spins it around, trying to get down that straightaway. He's still holding strong on that two spot. And it's a battle for that three spot. Silva is right in the monorail. Has to get marshaled out. So he's going to take a turn being at the bottom of the grid here. Caller in that four. Ethan in that three. One, two, and three are all evenly separated by about three seconds.
Caller and Silva by that start finish line. That's your closest battle right there. As they work their way in front of the driver's stand. It's still a long race. You're only two and a half in. You got three and a half to go. Kyle just trying to put together a smooth laps, uh, but making sure he doesn't settle too much. Again, puts it upside down, and here comes somebody. That's Ethan. Ethan <laughs> gets a wheel from Gatton, and he tries to give it back on that step up, step down. There goes Caller. So Gatton is now uh, back in that two spot. Ethan trying to put some spurs in that wild stallion. As he works his way by the start finish line, I'm sorry, by the driver's stand. Someone puts it upside down. I think that was Caller. And Silve's in the hunt now. So the teammates, TLR teammates, Ethan and Silve are battling it out for that three spot. As they come by that start finish line. Are they going to battle out or are they going to try to work together, try and reel in Gatton? Gatton went huge. Aired out that quad, landed downside like a boss. Kyle Davis still out front. He's got an 8.6 second lead over Gatton. Oh, Gatton puts it in the weeds, has to marshal himself out. That allows Silve to move around. And there's Caller now. Caller and Gatton touch each other. Silve puts it upside down. No one wants this number two spot, but right now Caller's got it. Gatton and Silve are in the hunt. Caller gives it up. Silve, or Gatton puts it upside down. He's down in the canyon. Caller gets hung up on left. the pipe. Jeez. That moves Silve into that two spot. So after a rough stop, start by Silve, he's now in that number two spot. And there comes Kyle Davis in that one spot, looking to put a lap on a gaggle of these cars. Kyle's got his car hooked up. He is making it through all these portions nice and smooth. Everyone else are having issues with their own separate parts of the track. I think Gatton moved into the two there. Caller back into the three. So looks like Silve had a rough one. We'll see what's going on when we come by the start finish line. Yes, Kyle Davis in the one. Gatton moves into the two. So two, three, and four have been swapping, swapping places. One minute left. Left and right here. Rumble strip got the better of Caller. He goes upside down. And Silva is going to move back into that, th or moving to the three spot, anyways. Gatton goes backwards. Silva can see him, but everyone's still in the hunt for that two spot. Rumble strip's got these guys' number. Kyle Davis is going to get around. Gatton pushes it wide. That allows Kyler to go around. Silve back into that two. 18 seconds left. Kyle going to take a little breather in the, in the valley there, in the dugout. He's going to get around for his victory lap right here. Five seconds left. And you will be done when you cross that line. Ethan, you're done. It is battle for second place and third and fourth. Got into one another. And Keller gets it wrong. It's like a repeat of the four-wheel drive. Jim Silve taking that two. Kyle taking the win. Everyone is done. All stop, all stop. Taking the win. Kyle Davis in the two. Jim Silve in the three. Ryan Keller. All stop, all stop. The race is completed. That is a race. Again, thank you all for coming on out. Hope you all had a good time. Make sure you have a safe drive home. And we have open practice until 530. Track will be open until 530.